were people on the other side of the fence. They all jumped to attention whenever the soldiers approach. Sometimes they fall to the ground. Sometimes they don't get up. The story begins in the 1940s. At the beginning, Bruno comes home to find their family maid, Maria, packing their things away in boxes. The family will move away to Ber Berlin. He complains to his mom, dad, and his sister, but he's out of luck because they aren't changing their mind anytime soon because of his dad's new job. In addition to his luck, his new house is weak. It's way smaller than their old house. His old house was five stories. It was isolated, and there was a big wire fence near the house that Bruno had. And he had a lovely view of it from his window. Bruno can see little boys while looking at the fence, but realizes he can't see only little boys, but men of all ages. They wear striped pajamas and gold wristbands. Bruno tells his sister, Gretel, that the children look unfriendly. His story ends by Bruno climbing under the fence, and he was never seen again. His family tries to deal with his disappearance. In the meantime, Bruno's sister, Gretel, and their mom eventually go back to Berlin. But their fa father stays in Auschwitz. His father has a sudden insight and retraces Bruno's steps. He soon realizes what happened to Bruno. The story ends by allies coming to Auschwitz and Bruno's father recording, ordering them to go with him. Honestly, I would rate this book three stars because it has a very good plot, but it was a kind of a boring read. But it was worth reading because you got to learn what people went through through that time. Um, but I would read it, don't take my word for it. Um, I felt upset because Bruno didn't really do very smart things because he climbed under the fence. I don't, really don't know why. Um, but I can't also tell you why I was sad. I was sad too, but I can't tell you why I was sad because that would be a spoiler for the book. This book is an example of facing a challenge and desire to escape. Enjoy the book.